it's currently 11 a.m. and it's Sunday. I literally just woke up. These past couple days, I've been so sick that I like cough nonstop from like 12 to like 2 a.m. So I haven't been sleeping that well. But it's midterm week. I actually only have one midterm um, before reading week. So we're just gonna be working on that this week. And I have a couple assignments due, so we're gonna be going through those as well. But first, I need to get up and shower, and we're gonna do some errands today. Just finished my shower, and I put my hair up into braids because I like it when my hair is like wet, and I put them in braids because the next day it's like a nice, like wavy curl so i don't have to do it but i'm just waiting for my hair strainer to heat up so i can curl my bangs a little bit and then makeup look for today is just tinted brow gel i curl my lashes and natural blush of coughing and sickness and i'll probably put some lip balm on later but yeah this is a look booked my doctor's appointment for tomorrow i really hope they prescribe me something because i swear my cough has been getting worse and it's like to the point where i cough so much at night that i can barely get any sleep so i really hope that they can give me some like i don't know cough syrup but i swear all the doctors in london are just like specialized in giving doctors notes and not actually giving like a treatment but anyways this is my ootd so this is really giving sick diseased girl comfy on a sunday um hoodies from amazon t-shirts from ghani and pants are from taobao slay i love these pants they're so nice finished grocery shopping i literally love grocery shopping i feel like my serotonin is so high right now it's like my favorite thing to do anyways i am going to shoppers right now because i need to get a refill on nyquil so more errands yay this is my first meal of the day lunch slash dinner i basically heated up my meal prep udon and i put a bit of seaweed salad on I've been trying to figure out what the hell this says for like the past 30 minutes. Anyways, this is my setup right now. Got the entire Apple ecosystem out. But anyways, I'm just gonna eat and maybe watch Bob's Burgers. We can figure out this assignment later. in the morning all i really did was i submitted two of my assignments that i had done um that are due tomorrow and tuesday and then i've been working on this one assignment for so long because it's like my hardest course and i like don't know if i'm doing this right but thankfully they let us use chat gpt in this course which is why i feel like he made it way harder because like i swear chat gpt doesn't even know how to do it anyways something that was really funny today is my roommates and I are doing this thing where we compare each other's day lists because they always come up being the most like stupid thing ever, like lit bougie Sunday morning. So today I got hopeless romantic cat Sunday afternoon. My roommate got the exact same thing, but she got main character. Why is mine cat? Yeah, so that's stupid. Anyways, I hope my day list is a bit better tomorrow. Um, I think I'm gonna grind this out for another like 10, 15 minutes. And I'm just gonna go to bed early today and maybe wake up early to do this assignment. Ugh, I hope magically I get smarter in my sleep so I know how to do these questions. Anyways, good night, guys. Happy Sunday, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Morning, guys. Happy Monday. Today, I actually have 
no classes because one class is async and then the other class got pushed to tomorrow because we have a speaker event so i'm gonna use today's time to just grind out my assignment um catch up on lectures for another class and then i'm gonna go to the gym right now so this is how we have today so my top is from lululemon my leggings i think are from amazon so i'm just gonna put a hoodie over this and then my jacket and then go so i hope everyone has a wonderful day Sometimes it could be so complicated No need to be so hard on yourself When you're ready for you Ta-da! So this is the final product for my dinner I stir fried some broccoli And then this is um, soy marinated short rib that I air fried And sprinkled a little bit of sesame on So I'm really excited to eat this I feel like it's a pretty well balanced meal and I have rice under So I hope all of you guys are eating well Guess who's back at Shoppers again? from shoppers and i got my prescription hopefully it works and can get some sleep tonight but tell me why the wait time for this was 40 minutes like i swear were they making this from scratch for 40 minutes like all i could do was i went aisle to aisle and i read every single valentine's card birthday card get well soon card Ugh. But anyways, now I'm so knowledgeable about cards. Like, if you guys ever need birthday cards, hit me up because I have them all memorized. <laughs> so this is the outfit of the day. So sweater is a speed neck sweater, kind of fuzzy, and it's from Urban Outfitters. And then my jeans are these like straight baggy ones, and they're from Drift Avenue. So I have a pretty chill day today. I have one class and then I'm gonna go to office hours to ask my TA about this one question on this assignment. It's like worded kind of weird. So I wanted to get like clarification on if I was doing it right. And then we have a speaker event today for our women leadership class. So that's fun. And then, yeah, I'm probably gonna go home after that and just like eat. And then we have our Edge versus Ivy hockey game which I'm really excited for. I really hope they sell like hot dogs or like pretzels there because oh my god, I want a hot dog so bad. <laughs> Boyfriend goes. Hey guys. The weather is so nice today and I genuinely feel like all my seasonal depression just like evaporated. I've never been happier. I'm literally thriving. Um, my roommates and I, like after my office hours, I went to go meet them at a cafe and then we decided to go get boba together. Look at the size of this thing. It's like literally the size of my face. But I got the panda milk tea from Pressel Tea and it's so good. But I swear I need to not drink boba because that is the reason I was sick in the first place, but uh, it's so good. And then later today, we're gonna go play badminton at the rec center. Um, I don't know, I feel like I'm in such a girly spring mood today. I'm literally so happy. But I'm gonna finish up my assignment before I go and then we have a hockey game tonight. I'm really excited for that. So this is a new fit for badminton. I have this shirt that I thrifted which has this like cute little bunny and it's fruit loops on it. I'm wearing my Dreamers Club hoodie cause it's so warm today. And then I have shorts under these sheets. Yay, I'm really excited for badminton, but I feel like I'm gonna get destroyed, but whatever, YOLO. my ivy sweater on same jeans as this morning and then i have this leather jacket i think from zara
ready for bed um but generally today was like one of the most fun days we ever had the weather was so nice it was just like super eventful and i got to hang out with my roommates a lot which was just really nice and the hockey game was really fun um unfortunately ivy actually didn't win the hockey game and she won but to be honest the engineer team played really really well like they were like head to head for every single shot so honestly good for them um, I finished all my CS assignments today, finally, and I'm just happy to get that out of the way so we can start our CNS midterm grind tomorrow. Anyways, I hope you guys all have a wonderful night. Happy Wednesday, guys. So this is the outfit of the day. I have this Reformation top underneath. Um, I'm pairing it with a TNA varsity jacket that I thrifted, and then I'm wearing the effortless pants. Yeah, so this is it. Have a pretty chill day today. I just have two classes and then we're gonna start the midterm grind. <laughs> today has been such a busy day. Oh my God, like I have not eaten anything except for like three grapes and this is my dinner right now. Hopefully I get home early from studying today so I can like make food, but Ugh, I'm literally so hungry. I just took an everything shower and it was literally the most therapeutic thing ever. The water was like burning hot, which I literally love. And I exfoliated, I left my conditioner in for like five minutes and it was just like really nice. But now I'm gonna put on this eye mask that my roommate got me for Secret Santa. And it's a crystal collagen gold powder eye mask. So I'm really excited for that. So the eye mask is on and it is so cute. I'm literally obsessed. I wanna like, get more and it's like the softest thing ever. Wait, I'm, I literally love it. I'm so happy right now. It is so cute, holy shit. But I actually don't know if I put it on right because why do I feel like it's like not symmetrical? Anyways, I'm literally so happy right now. Morning guys! So this is the outfit of the day. I'm wearing this sweater that I got from China, I think like five years ago. And then I'm pairing them with the Levi overalls. Yeah, so I'm gonna run to class because I think I'm literally gonna be late. Got back from class. And honestly, I'm starting to like that class a lot more because I feel like I'm actually like understanding the content and it doesn't seem like that hard. Um, but I was feeling a little dizzy today for some reason so I'm gonna eat some ramen that I made and then I'm gonna eat it with some cucumbers cause gotta get the fruit and veggies in and then my roommates and I are gonna go play badminton together at 1.30 so yeah also while I'm eating cause I don't wanna pass out This is Team Canada right here. Just came back from badminton and took a shower and now I'm changing to something a little bit more comfy because we're gonna go to Ivy and grind for the rest of tonight. We're hoping to get all of our notes in today so we can just like review and just like read our notes tomorrow and just take a chill. Friday so this is the OOTD I'm wearing a fuzzy blue like sweater from I think Sunday best and then I'm pairing them with my packs and jeans I bought my Elenium ticket yesterday which I'm so excited for it's like a two-day pass and it works perfectly because it's during Memorial Day weekend so I for sure don't have work and on Monday it's like also off so I get to recover um, 
but I'm really really excited. I feel like Elenium is like my favorite EDM artist. I like don't really listen to EDM, but his music is really good. And it's gonna be my first like rave. So I wanna look cute for it. And I'm really excited to like dress up, like buy clothes for it. But the only issue is that I have no idea how I'm supposed to get to like the Gorge Amphitheater because it's two or three hours away from like Seattle. Um, I know like one other person who's going and they have a car, so maybe I'll become best friends with them. Anyways, for today, all we're doing is reviewing one last time. I also need to download my exam onto Examplify because we like do it on our laptops, which is like so weird, but it's also closed book. Um, but I need to do that. And then my roommates and I ordered Hakka and Momo house. It's like this new place that opened um, after potato noodle closed. And I'm really excited because I really like Hakka food. Like my family and I always order out from this place in Mississauga and it's like super, super good. But I wonder if they'll make it just as good here. Cause I feel like sometimes like they make the chili chicken a little bit sweet and I'm not a fan of that, but we'll see. We'll get a review later. <laughs> So in the previous clip where we were in our kitchen and like Lisa's on the counter, like Val's like searching through all the cabinets, we were trying to look for this can of alphagetti. So basically back in first year, when we were all sweet mates at O'Hall, Lisa and I were roommates and then Karen and Val were roommates. We did this thing where we would hide a can of alphagetti in each other's rooms and we would have to try to find it. And we kept like the slip of paper around the alphagetti where we would write like the location and the date so we can keep track of to see like how long each like team would spend to try to find the alphagetti. And we recently found it again in our house. So we were like, oh, like it's our last year together. So we might as well like bring back this tradition and hide it only in like our kitchen and our like common area. So today was Karen's um, turn to hide it. And we spent like 45 minutes trying to find this can of alphabetti. We went through like the entire kitchen twice. Um, we looked behind our couch and then it was just like on the windowsill. But I'm really excited for when I get to hide it because today when we were searching, I have so many good ideas of where I'm gonna hide it. Like for example, under the trash bags. Like that's so smart. Anyways, um, I have a midterm tomorrow at 2 p.m. Clearly studying very hard, but I'm gonna get some sleep soon. And it's also Chinese New Year, so happy Chinese New Year, everyone. Hoping you guys all have a wonderful Dragon Year. Wishing happiness, health, and prosperity to you and your friends and your family. Yeah, so happy new year guys and I hope you guys all have a good night. did some last minute reviewing for my midterm and I just packed my bag and this is the outfit I'm wearing my essentials crew neck and then I'm pairing them with these baggy Paxson jeans I'm gonna go and eat a quick like small snack or like a mini lunch and then we're probably gonna head out to go to Ivy for our midterm to be honest I feel like we're all feeling pretty good for this so hopefully it goes well how do we feel? I feel good. You feel good? Yeah, I feel so good. Hi, besties. So your girl is done her one and only midterm before reading week. And I think it went pretty well. After our midterm, we went to Konjichan to celebrate Chinese New Year and we ate so, so much good food. I literally feel nine months pregnant right now and we're going out so I like need to de-bloat and not look nine months pregnant. 
Uh, but after Hunchy Chan, we went to Sugar Marmalade and had shaved ice and tang yuan, which was like, oh my god, literally the best. I'm such a sucker for dessert. Um, I've been craving tang yuan really, really bad because I've been seeing the fried tang yuan trend all over my TikTok. And I don't have any tang yuan here in London. So I've been like really, really wanting something with like mochi, like sticky rice. And oh, it satisfied my craving today. And we're going out to Cowboys later, so I don't know. I don't even know if this is like the vibe I'm supposed to dress for because I've never been. I think none of my roommates have been except for Lisa. And apparently it's like a like a ranch cowboy country vibe. So I'm wearing this top that I stole from my sister's closet. And then I think I'm just going to wear the same jeans that I wore to my midterm today. Uh, updates. I'm actually going home tomorrow because... My reading week is actually in two weeks, but I don't really have classes next week. So I'm just going to go home early and use the time to study for my midterms, which are after reading week. And I'm actually going to New York to visit my sister um, during reading week. So I'm trying to get most of my work out of the way so I can actually like hang out with her and do fun stuff in New York. But yeah, be on the lookout for my New York vlog. so it's already sunday um last night was honestly a lot of fun i actually really really like cowboys i think if i were to rank every single bar i've been to in london it would be seeps because seeps um number two i think would be cowboys and then number three would be delilah's i think i actually really liked the layout of cowboys and they had honestly really really good music last night um and i didn't think like country was ever gonna be my vibe but it was like super hype and i just had a lot of fun um my roommates and i got back i think around like two and we just decided to play we're not really strangers and we literally talked and like cried until 6 a.m but honestly i love them to death i feel like what we have as friends is something that you'll get once in a lifetime and i'm very very grateful for that so if you guys are watching this i literally love you and for anyone else go tell your friends you love them go tell your parents you love them and yeah i'll see you guys in new york vlog because i have a bus to catch at 11 um to go to toronto so thank you so much for watching what is this i'm feeling thoughts that are bleeding